Here we are with Cyberpunk Edge Runners. So yeah, I guess everyone knows Cyberpunk, right? The big hyped up game that flopped because it had many issues at launch and didn't keep many promises that I made. But despite all the bad things that the game had going at launch, while now being in a way, in a way better state, but still not perfect, um, I had still at launch 200 hours of great fun with the game. I had a good time. And so, yeah, I'm interested to see how the show goes, right? How they do things. And so, yeah, I'm very interested. We have 10 episodes. I will see. I guess I will upload one episode per day, maybe. I don't know. We will see. But yeah, if you like what you see, leave a like, subscribe, or comment. Let me know what you think. And I would say, let's get to the episode. They had a live, a live stream on Twitch yesterday where they showed the first three episodes, but I didn't watch it. <clears throat> I just wanted to wait for the official release, basically. And the good OST, pretty much like the game. Oh, he's glitching? Looks a bit like that. Shit luck. <laughs> well, I guess guns ain't doing shit here right now. Oh, <laughs> well, he's gone. <clears throat> yeah, this is just normal police. We know that they can't do shit. <clears throat> oh, there's a uh, mantis glaives. <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> Cut it off with his knee mantis blade. We didn't have those in the game. But imagine you had mantis blades in your legs and your arms. Oh. And you could just like run around and slice and dice. The time slow thing. I think we had that in the game, right? Something that can slow time for a moment. And here comes the real deal. <clears throat> well, he's he's not doing much against them. <laughs> I think they're called MacTech or something. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> You should aim for his mouth, where he's not armored. Was it just a game? Oh, it's a BD. Okay, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, we... Yeah. We know those. <laughs> oh, my God. God damn. <clears throat> 
Yeah, that must be a weird feeling, right? To experience something like that, as if it happened to you, just that it didn't. Oh. I thought it was a guy because it looked like he had a beard on the side, but it was just a hair. <clears throat> Oh, that's his mom, okay. Oh, his mom's on TV. Oh, she's working for like, a hospital. The good old sounds from the game. <clears throat> I guess they are more like at the bottom of the food chain, if you, if you want to say it like that. They are more like very far down. Or uh, probably just getting by. So I guess this might be an anime that is about him rising up or something. <clears throat> Maybe. Dude, he gets his dick pumped <laughs> in, the, in public. Holy shit. We didn't have that in the game. <laughs> It's itching. <clears throat> Crime scene. I guess from the news in the morning. The big ass fish. Oh. Oh. Hello. <laughs> and she's gone. Everyone is like, oh no, it's him. He's itching his implants. I, was, uh, I thought it was someone else. And I was like, dude, everyone is itching their implants. <clears throat> so yeah uh, the others have like better tech <laughs> they all got fried because of him Uh, 
Uh, guess that would be too much, really. <clears throat> I doubt that. Uh. <clears throat> I wonder if he maybe just used the money for the BD. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I knew that shit was going down when I saw the other cars pass by. But I didn't expect it this. I hope she's still alive. Is this maybe how he changes his path in life? That maybe the mother dies now? Or something? I guess she died, right? Oh. Let me guess she, they killed them? Or killed her or whatever? Maybe, I, I don't know, I don't think so, right? What? Or they just let her be there because it's not the person they're looking for. So they kind of kill her because they don't save her, right? Okay. Okay, she she's not dead. Okay, good. But maybe it gets very expensive.
did it say rent was up? <clears throat> and that's why it's what why it was locked. Okay, so she saved money up. Dang. I think it's a nice touch that his eyes are glowing a little bit. <clears throat> Selling BDs. <clears throat> it's like drugs, right? <laughs> Is this maybe from the guy we saw at the beginning? That maybe the dog took it out of the guy from the beginning that died, maybe? That would be interesting. And now he gets it, maybe, and with that he can, like, slow down time or something. The same stuff. All the school guys. <clears throat> mm hmm obviously. Oh. oh, he's going to flip. <clears throat> I guess he gets expelled today. Because <laughs> I guess he will beat him up. <clears throat> And I don't like him. Anime free web. <laughs> ah. Okay. I thought he just showed off, but no, he beats him up. Damn. <clears throat> These damn fucking bullies that think they are high and mighty because they have a better standing in life. But it's not anymore. Oh, so she died now.
Man, he really hit rock bottom now. Oh, this asshole. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This piece of shit. Can we beat him up? He uses it on. He wants it in him. Yep. I guess it's the wear from the guy at the beginning, right? <clears throat> oh, god damn, dude. What an episode. Okay, that was episode one. Let me know what you think. But yeah, I had to rewatch the whole episode because I missed so much. Um, I felt like I missed much and indeed I did. Um, so what I missed was basically, for example, the first time he mentioned that it was her, uh, his mother. Um, that... Is something I completely missed. I catched it later when he said it like the second time or so. <clears throat> and what I also missed is that in the news they said that the cyberware was missing. And I missed that in the jacket of the mother the cyberware was inside at the beginning of the episode, right? So, of course, if she's like at the place where the crime happened and basically picks the guy up, right? For the hospital or whatever. Um, yeah, she took it out of him, I guess, and took it with her so that she can probably sell it so that they get money, right? Because obviously, like you can see in this episode, they are basically at the bottom. <clears throat> I mean, they are not completely rock bottom, right? But they are pretty low when it comes to like uh, life standards. Um, rent is like due. The washing machine is not paid up. Um, she needs money for the upgrades for his, her son, Mio. Um, for the school and all that stuff, she has to pay intuition fees and all that stuff. Um, so because she just wants the best for her son, right? It's a typical mother, that, a mother, that, 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 mother that wants the best for her son, like give him the best chance in life, and <clears throat> so that he can make career and have a good life later on, right? But yeah, because of that, everything else is not of high standard right they don't have the best like i said uh, living standards right and so <clears throat> yeah like i said in the episode i think that maybe the money the mother gave him he maybe spent it on the bd maybe um and instead he got some cheap bad upgrade that didn't work with the with the new technology or system they had in school and so it fucked up everything and that's why the mother got called and obviously they're like yeah because of the of the character right that he is not like a good student i would say right he's like more a bit of a yeah rebel maybe if you want to say it like that or like yeah he's not like I would say he's from his character he's not like a good student right he's more like just passes by and probably does like the minimum or tries his best but is not good enough um and is not really the person that is like friendly to everyone right he has like his own character and his own 
way of dealing with things and others. And so, yeah, he is not... When it comes to, like, characters or people that are, like, higher in the hierarchy, like the assholes we saw in this episode, um, that have, like, money, that are rich, and all that stuff, and are very arrogant because of it, yeah, he's not getting getting along with those people, right? And so, yeah, I mean, at first I thought, yeah, maybe he can beat him up, and that's how he drops out of school, right? Um, but, yeah, it makes sense. I mean, in this world, cyberware is everything. Not everything, but pretty pretty big part, right? It If you can beat up someone, then cyberware plays a big part. And so if, he, if that kid is rich and has, like, good cyberware, obviously he can beat up someone else that might be stronger otherwise, right? So, yeah. That is unfortunate and then obviously um when the whole accident happened on the on the highway because they got caught up in like some uh what do you want to call it uh, some like uh gang fight um yeah the, the trauma team didn't pick them up because apparently they weren't clients um so yeah that sucks i mean they just care for the clients that pay obviously right um which is interesting because later they said that if he can't pay for the intuition fee and everything, then stuff gets like cancelled, right? And it's like they mentioned trauma team. So maybe you need trauma team if you are in the school. Maybe that's like standard, you like something you have to have. And so maybe they didn't have it. I don't know. It's I I mean like I said, I don't know. Uh, or maybe they didn't have it and it's not something you need. It's just something that gets cancelled if you can't pay. <clears throat> because the trauma team said that the mother isn't the client and that he isn't the client. So, yeah. And that's why they left them and because of that, ultimately, the mother died. Because they couldn't afford good treatment. And yeah, it's just like completely rock bottom, right? It's I guess really that this show is like basically you go from zero to hero, basically. Not... not necessarily hero but like you really this episode was basically you absolutely hit rock bottom you probably have like no one left in your life right now um like no friends probably nothing really <clears throat> and yeah your mother just died you have no money really you just have this one cyberware that is like that everyone is like looking for like dealer and police and now you use that because you can't really sell it because people just screw you over with like low prices and you will probably use it and with that he gets the power to go up in life i guess and then i mean it could go either way right it could go either that he raises or, or that he rises from bottom to top and gets a good life or something or maybe it could even end with him dying at the end i could see that happen that he tries it that he gets to a point where he is like further up and then maybe something happens and he dies it will be interesting right um but yeah otherwise it's just a super shit show right and this arrogant douchebag from the school just rubs it in and uh insinuates i think is a word uh, that his mother did some things, right, to get the money for Mio to get into the school for the intuition fee and all that stuff, and then beats him up and everything, and when the mother's dead, then he even calls him and rubs it more in, right, and trash talks. It's just so messed up. This is such a fucking douche. I hope we beat him up at some point. I hope he comes back when he has a cyberware and is like, yeah, I want to fight again, bitch. Let's go. And then, yeah, um, he goes to the dog and wants the cyberware implant, implanted, like I said. So, will be interesting to see. And, I mean, there were some interesting things. Obviously, the not safe for work stuff. I wonder how much more we saw, uh, how much more we see of this. Because I watched some trailers of it, which I can barely remember anything of. But one trailer was the not, 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 not safe for work trailer. And, yeah, I saw these scenes that we saw in this episode in the net in the not safe work trailer so i'm wondering how much more we will see did they 
blue all the not safe for work stuff in the first episode <laughs> um to pop off big basically or will there be more right will be interesting to see if there's more of that like i said and yeah we also saw like the girl with the white hair that is also like on <clears throat> um covers or uh key arts whatever for the show right on posters whatever so she will be interesting she will be main character i guess will be interesting to see in what sense because she wasn't dressed like a student and i think they were on school ground when we saw her the first time i guess so yeah but i guess that was pretty much the episode right um i think it was a great first episode really enjoyed it and it basically gave us yeah the groundwork i guess right <clears throat> our main character isn't an honorary student or something like that right he's basically a free spirit you might say um isn't getting along with everyone really um it's more like rebellious and tries to just get by i guess and then the mother obviously wants the best for her and be and they obviously live not a great life but the mother just basically pumps, uh, pumps everything into the intuition for for her son that he gets a better life and then she dies tragically and that basically throws out uh, uh, throws us at rock dude i can't talk today jesus christ i throws us at rock bottom okay and from here we go and try to go up i guess but yeah if you like what you see leave a like subscribe or comment let me know what you think it will say thanks for watching until next time bye bye